you like. See what the state of Georgia got the alpha or sister, you know what I'm saying? Embrace the Arkansas chick. When I go, I hope I meet wonderful people that really want to see you grow and empower me. I hope I meet so many people who are doing it and just I ain't gonna have no other excuse but to get up and do it myself and stay encouraged because of their strength and the energy that I see and the motivation that I see there. We got some tired ass people in the state of Arkansas. I'm not gonna even kid and lie to you. But they may think that about me. That's not true by far. Y'all know I get my hands dirty. I get, I get my hands dirty. I clean up for a living. Damn. Man, T.I. T.I. My favorite rapper right about now. I love T.I. Bro, go up to you, my brother, for all the struggle and the hardship you endured. But that movie ATL, whether it was true or not, T.I. You are... An inspiration to me. He have always been an inspiration to me, cause I know the brother come from from from. He speak the truth of where he come from. Most of them rappers be lying. Ti came from a hard times. You know what I'm saying? Came from hard times, and I know this man. I know he seemed to be sincere. He just looks sincere. <laughs> I love that. Much props to you, Tiny. But man. You know what I'm saying? He had to do what he had to do, you know what I'm saying, in that movie, clean up to get to where he wanted to be. I'm tired of cleaning up. I ain't trying to clean up to get to where I, I want to be in life. I'm trying to stay focused on those things that grow from those, what, I, what it is I want to do. I want to be a true artist. I want to be an entertainer. That's what I want to be, a full-time entertainer. Like, I'm talking about paid and I don't have to do nothing else but create. Create for the United States. Create for the United States. Create for the United States, man. That's what I want to do. I want to write music. I want to write poetry. I want. I do all these things. I just want it published. I want my stuff moving. I want to be a millionaire. You hear me? But even if I don't get to millionaire status, let me make a couple hundred thousand. I'm good. In this great. Boy, 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 boy. Sometimes life is a. I'm not gonna say that word because I know I got kids out there looking at me and be looking up on YouTube and stuff. Be, I don't be like cussing a lot and stuff because that's not like good role model. I try not to. At least since I'm not rich right now <laughs> and I need a job right now, I think I'm just gonna go to Georgia. And utilize these skills that I have. These skills and cleaning up. Because I do such a good job. As y'all see, the building is not really nasty. It stay clean. It stay clean. If my hands in it, baby. See, they say cleanliness is the, is the closest thing to godliness. That's why I don't mind getting my hands dirty. Keeping things around me nice and clean. Or wherever I'm paid to do it at. You know what I'm saying? Even if I'm not paid. I got to keep where I lay my head at clean. You know what I'm saying? I have to. I can't stand no filthy, filthy house or just living in filth. It's nasty. My car on the other hand. <laughs> my car, you know, inside on the other hand. Ooh, it's a struggle for me to keep my car clean on the inside. I got papers all in the back, all in the window, all flying out of the window when I'm driving down the street. All because I'm just too smart. Try to be smart anyway. I'm a nerd. I try to keep papers and books and stuff around me all the time. So read, people. Read. Read. Reading and education is your key to success and it is your way out of the hood. At least that's what they told me. But damn, I'm still cleaning up buildings. <sighs> Was going to college a really 